Hi, my name is Robert Hawk and I'm a freelance Sitecore developer from the Netherlands and multiple Sitecore MVP. In this short video I'm going to show you a bug that I recently discovered and currently applies to the latest version of Sitecore. It's uh, Sitecore version 8.1 update 1. It's a December 7, 2015 release. The bug occurs when, uh, when we're having a multi-line text field and when we're using a custom experience button uh, to have multiple lines uh, in, in the multi-line text field. So now I'm going to edit and I'm going to say line 2. So I'm going to save this field and the values get correctly on separate lines. But however, uh, when I'm using a custom experience button, when I'm actually editing uh, when I'm actually editing the field here this is line 1 this is line 2 when I now click OK then both lines get stored on the same line so this is an incorrect behavior of, uh, of the multi-line text field uh, with use of a custom experience button so when I'm in the content editor or page editor it works uh, correctly so on the home item, on the sample item, I've just added a multi-line text field. So if I now save it, then it actually gets stored on two lines. So when I refresh the page, uh, the values are stored on two lines. So the problem lies in uh, a multi-line text field in combination with a, a customer experience button. So this was actually acknowledged by Sitecore support and recognized as a bug. So in case you want uh, uh, to have a fix for this, you can use uh, reference number uh, 377374 and you can actually download it uh, on my blog. I will put a link uh, to the blog page uh, uh, below this video. So Sitecore support provided us with a uh, hotfix. It contains a DLL and a config file. So copy the DLL to your Sitecore instance and copy the config file to the include folder. Okay. And then do a refresh. So when we now come back to the multi-line text, uh, text field and we're actually editing it through the experience uh, to the custom experience button, line one, line two, and now it is correctly on two separate lines. So when we check, out, check it out in the content editor, we have both the values on two lines. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video.